Hi, in this video, we're going to see how to edit your Zoom shortcut keys. So to do that, you simply need to go to the shortcut keys first. And to do that, you would just go to settings at the top right under your profile picture and select keyboard shortcuts. Second from the bottom, here are the descriptions of what the particular shortcut does. Of course, very convenient and it makes using Zoom so easy. Uh, so what you need to do is if you want to change a particular shortcut now let's say that it's about navigating among zoom pop-up windows so the default shortcut is f6 but let's say you want to change it to something more suited to your needs or something which you might remember easily for example n for navigate so you would want to replace this f6 with the letter n so just click on this f6 here just click on this once and now press backspace there it's removed and now just press the shortcut key you want to be used in our case it is the letter n so i would just press n and there i would just click once and it has been saved here now i can use n to navigate amongst my zoom pop-up windows similarly here i could see the alt plus v for stopping the video in here if i want to change this to only v because maybe that is easier for me to do. So I just want to remove the Alt key. I would just use V in the future. So I would just click on this once, press backspace. Now pressing, sorry, now pressing V and now clicking once again. And there you go. V is my new shortcut key. I could also do this if I want to use multiple keys for the shortcut. For example, here, let me show you. Uh, the starting and stopping screen sharing option is done via alt plus s now let's say i want to do it with shift plus s instead of alt plus s so what i would do is i would just click on this once and press backspace and now my two keys are shift plus s so i would press shift and at the same time i would press s there you go so to start and stop my screen sharing i would now use shift and s okay so this is how you could just amend any of these uh there's one more option i want to show you which is this one restore defaults now for example you have made a bit of a mess of all the shortcut keys or maybe you just want to reset all of them and then define your own new shortcuts so in that case you would just have to click on restore defaults and here the f6 is back and here the alt plus v is back in here you could see the changes for yourself all the default shortcut keys have been now available to you instead of your own customized ones and uh, let's also see this little option enable global shortcut what this does is that even when you're not in the zoom app itself these shortcut keys would still work this option is uh, available or valid for only some of these for example here it isn't but here it is so you could just click on this and now uh, for this particular shortcut page up which is about viewing the previous page of video participants and gallery view this shortcut has been enabled globally and uh, you could even read it here the this could be used even when the zoom app is not in focus so let's say it's running in the background you can still press this and this would happen this particular action would be executed so this is how you could change any of these shortcut keys according to your own convenience and your own needs depends on what is easier for you to memorize or easier for you to use and it's a very simple process you just saw that so uh, by all means do this and your zoom experience would be so much the more better